Hi, I'm Tim. I'm Declan. And this is Reverse Engineering Experimental Labs. AKA Rex Labs. Where we take things apart and see how they work. Today we're going to take apart a, a remote control car so you can see what's inside. Oh, I also forgot my safety goggles. Okay, I'm ready. First, we're going to take out the batteries. So we looked at it, and there seems to be four Phillips head screws. So we're going to use a Phillips head screwdriver from this set that you can get at your local hardware store. Okay, so I took out the four screws. Now I'm gonna take the top from the bottom. Ooh, I can't get it off because the wires are connected. Cool, a circuit board. These red and green wires um, lead to the front and rear lights, which are probably LEDs. We're going to cut the wires so we can take the top off. Okay, so this is the circuit board. There's the on and off switch. On and off. Here's the wire from the batteries to go to the circuit board, which sends signals to turn on the motor in the back to to make the wheels turn, and there's a motor in the front to make the wheels turn from side to side. Why are you staring at me? <laughs> no, the thing is, it's like, it, it's like it has an eye, it's scary. And we're gonna take apart the front to get the, the front motor that turns the wheels from side to side, and we're gonna take apart the back to, to get the back motor that accelerates the wheels. Sometimes these screws can be hard to get started, so I'm going to start a couple of these for deck because they're a little bit difficult. Now that is what I call some gears. Okay. So that's what's inside of a remote control car. We used a Phillips head screwdriver from a set of precision screwdrivers that are used for getting out those tiny screws. And we used wire cutters to snip the wires throughout the car. Okay, and then we found two motors. One controlling the back wheels. Making them go forward and backward. And the motor in the front. Controlling the steering and they had an interesting set of gears to turn the front wheels right and left. And right in the middle, we found the circuit board controlling all of the functions. That's our share for today. Don't forget to come to rexlabs.com and tell us what you like to take apart. See you next time on Rex Labs. <laughs> Where we take things apart. And see how they work. Bye. Bye. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cut that out.